Welcome to USMLEFastTrack.com. The section we're going to talk about today is from First Aid for the USMLE Step 1, 2013 edition. Page 463. What is schizophrenia? Schizophrenia is a chronic mental disorder with periods of psychosis, disturbed behavior and thoughts, and a decline in functioning that lasts more than six months. What is schizophrenia associated with? Schizophrenia is associated with increase in dopaminergic activity and decrease in dendritic branching. Name all the symptoms required to diagnose schizophrenia. The symptoms required to diagnose schizophrenia includes delusions, hallucination, which is often auditory, disorganized speech that has loose association, disorganized or catatonic behavior, along with negative symptoms. Out of the five symptoms mentioned, the top four are positive symptoms. From the five symptoms mentioned, how many do you need to diagnose schizophrenia? Out of the five mentioned, two or more are required to diagnose schizophrenia. What are the negative symptoms of schizophrenia? The negative symptoms of schizophrenia are flat effect, social withdrawal, lack of motivation, and lack of speech or thought. What is flat effect? Flat effect is when a person has no emotional expression. So to diagnose schizophrenia, you are required to have two or more of these five symptoms. And if that's not the case, then you have to diagnose them with something else. Brief psychotic disorder, schizophreniform disorder, or schizoaffective disorder. What is brief psychotic disorder? What is brief psychotic disorder? Brief psychotic disorder is a disorder that lasts less than one month and is usually stress-related. What is schizophreniform disorder? Schizophreniform disorder is a disorder that lasts one to six months. What is schizoaffective disorder? Schizoaffective disorder is when there is at least two weeks of stable mood with psychotic symptoms. Plus, there also has to be a major depressive, manic, or a mix of both episode. What are the two subtypes of schizoaffective disorder? The two subtypes of schizoaffective disorder include bipolar and depressive disorder. What are the five subtypes of schizophrenia? The five subtypes of schizophrenia includes paranoid, which has delusions, disorganized, in which there is disorganized speech and behavior, along with flat effect, which means they don't have any emotional expression. The third is the catatonic type, in which there is automatism. In this, the person has immo is immobile, or they exhibit agitated or purposeless movement. The fourth is undifferentiated, in which there is a little bit of elements of everything we talked about, such as paranoid, disorganized, and catatonic. So there is a little bit of all of that. And the fifth one is the residual type, where there is positive symptoms, but only at a low intensity. What are some factors that may have an effect on the cause of schizophrenia? Genetics and environment contributes to the ideology of schizophrenia. What can cause schizophrenia and psychosis in teens? Frequent cannabis use has been associated with psychosis and schizophrenia in teens. What is the lifetime prevalence of schizophrenia? Lifetime prevalence of schizophrenia is 1.5%. So everyone in their lifetime has 1.5% chance of getting schizophrenia. And males are equally affected as females, as well as blacks are equally affected as whites. But in men, the disease presents at an earlier age than it does in women. And in men, it presents at late teens to early 20s versus late 20s to early 30s in women. Patients with schizophrenia are at increased risk of doing what? Schizophrenia patients are at an increased risk of committing suicide. For more information on this topic, click on the link in the description section below. For a full USMLE Step 1 review, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com where we help you review the entire first aid for the USMLE Step 1 with high quality videos and hundreds of detailed pictures for a better understanding of the material. So to learn from the best USMLE review book, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com.